So my position is Congregational Care Coordinator. That's a lot of words that start with C and for what my position is meant to achieve, there's a couple other words that start with C that I want to add. The first word is compassion. Compassion is feeling sympathy or concern for others and feeling a need to act on it. And I think that's one of the vital components of congregational care is the understanding that we all have our challenges, we all face difficulties in this life, and if we can come alongside each other and provide support, that makes us all stronger in the end. So I really think that a major component of congregational care is showing compassion to one another. The second word that starts with C that I want to mention is connection. I view my position as one that facilitates connection between people who need care and people that are able to provide that care. The mask drive was really born out of the knowledge that there are people who are making masks and that there are people who need masks because we all need masks right now. And so my hope was that the church could become a bridge between those two groups. And the generosity that has been shown through the mask drive has been, frank, quite frankly, astonishing. There's another area of congregational care that where people have shown amazing generosity. Um, when the quarantine first started, we formed a team made up of deacons and other volunteers that were ready, willing, and able to deliver essential items to those that would not be able to leave their homes. We had so many people respond so quickly saying that they wanted to help, but we haven't had very many people require those services, which has been kind of wonderful to see, to know that there is such generosity and there is such willingness to say, yes, I can help. And it's, it's truly been a blessing to see that. So to finish, I'd like to mention the Congregational Care Line. This is a phone number that I made sure we set up fairly early on in my tenure here, just for the fact that we were in a quarantine situation where we're not in the church building very frequently. And so we still wanted to make sure that there was a way people could reach out and say, hey, I need a little help. That That's one of the main purposes of the Congregational Care Line is to make sure people know that we are here and ready to support you in whatever way we can. My position, the work of the deacons and other volunteers is only possible through the tithes and offering that the congregation provides. So thank you for your support and your consideration.